Hey, Principal Schiller, it's Myron Martin at the Smith Center. Can you hear me? I can, yes. Yeah, can you yay. hear me? I, I can. I, I, um, I appreciate you letting me call into your meeting. I know you're talking mariachi this morning, and, and uh, I just wanted to kind of ask a couple of questions, one involving mariachi and, and uh, whether or not uh, maybe we could have uh, mariachi perform at the Heart of Education Awards one year. Um, Mr. Avia, I just wonder, would that be good? <laughs> that would be awesome. <laughs> okay. Well, you know, this year we don't get to have an award show. So, so you know, the thing that keeps us going is thinking about doing the Heart of Education Awards in the future. And, and as a teacher, do you think that's something we should continue? Yes, sir. Can you tell me why? It's, it's, it's just, for a teacher, it's awesome to be, like, um, appreciated like that to be for us to get that award is awesome you know just to be a finalist to be nominated it, it makes you feel great because you're doing something you love and being appreciated and and you were nominated this year right yes last year and this year last year and this year how, how, so how does it feel when you get those emails uh saying that you've been nominated yeah, it feels absolutely amazing um I get emotional every time because of the, the words that are written. Uh, and and Anne, what do you think? Is is are we doing okay? Should we continue doing Heart of Education? Oh, of course, <laughs> of course. It, uh, yes, it is. Um, it is just a beacon of of pride, and the teachers deserve it. It's just a phenomenal community program that recognizes some of the hardest workers in Las Vegas with the biggest hearts. Well, you're, you're right. It gives us great pride and the Rogers Foundation, uh, great pride to be able to do this thing. We, we just wish we could have the awards this year. But of course, during the pandemic, we can't uh, bring 2000 people together at the Smith Center like we would love to do. And so Unfortunately, uh, Mr. Avi, you don't get to walk the red carpet this year, but, but I can tell you this, you were nominated. I, I knew the answer to that question. And the reason is because I also know that you're one of this year's winners of the Heart of Education Awards. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh my goodness. Thank you so much. Oh my so, goodness. So well. <laughs> How's it feel? It feels amazing. <laughs> Very good. This is great. I mean, like you said, I mean, like we work so hard and and it's just for the kids. I'm sorry, I cannot keep it together right now. <laughs> well, Mariachi is such an important program. And of course, at Fremont, you're known as Mr. Mariachi. It's, it's such an important aspect of, of teaching kids about culture and about history and about heritage. And uh, these are all really important things. It shows that you go above and beyond, just like uh, we ask our Heart of Education winners to do. Yes, sir. I mean, and it's daily. It's it's even now, even now during the pandemic. Even now. It's always. Well, listen, you uh, are going to get your award. You're going to get that beautiful medallion that you can show off to all your kids and your friends and your family. And uh, tomorrow, if you'd like, uh, you can stop by and pick up your check for 5000 bucks. Sure. I mean... <laughs> I guess. I mean, I'm not just over one of the whole thing. This is awesome. <clears throat> Are you recording this? Like, visually? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> uh, okay. um, um, I would like to thank the Rogers Foundation for just doing what you guys do, you know, celebrating teachers and making this just an amazing event and thank you very very much perfect perfect congratulations to both of you fremont middle school now has a 
Heart of Education winner that uh, you'll all be proud of for many years to come. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Ms. Schiller, anything to add about uh, this great program and about Donato's work? Well, I can tell you that when, when he came, uh, was eight years ago, nine years ago, Ten. he he had a woefully underfunded, underprepared, no instruments, hardly any students, and he single-handedly built it into just this symphony, and just it is the pride and the star of Fremont, and it is his work, his tenacity, a hundred percent. So this, I tell you, he is a top pick for heart of education, absolutely. Well, congratulations again. Congratulations to both of you. Thanks for letting me call in. I don't know if you're still going to talk about returning instruments or not, but uh, this was the real reason to celebrate you today. <laughs> congratulations. And we'll see you guys later. Thank you very, Thank very you. much. All right. Take care. Thank